Ghana added again. Another world-class hospital in Ghana. Dr. Armstead said that Ghana might become a top destination for medical tourists. Ghana has the potential to develop into a popular destination for medical tourists throughout all of West Africa, according to Dr. Rodney Armstead, president of Luka Health Medical Specialty Center. In Ghana, the need for readily available, high-quality healthcare services is more critical than ever. Specialty procedures and consultations are provided by Luca Health without charge. We adhere to, as our superb team of medical professionals and nurses will show you. Opportunities exist to enhance healthcare. As a result, Luca Health is here to collaborate with Ghanaian institutions and physicians to deliver top-notch medical expertise and specialization to Ghana. According to Dr. Armstead, Luca Health has received significantly more funding than the majority of other Ghanaian hospitals, but he anticipates an equally disproportionate reward. In comparison to 2020, Dr. Armstead projects a 50 increase in yearly revenue, with a 30 operating margin and a 45% EBITDA. That would be the result of a significant 62,000 interactions, consultations, imaging diagnostics, and procedures. The transformative legacy of Luca Health is more important than its potential for financial gain. One of Dr. Armstead's best days as a business executive, according to him, was the day the first Luca Health campus opened. Hello and thank you for visiting Africa Reloaded. Discover yet another outstanding hospital in Ghana by staying with us. Please subscribe to our channel and leave a comment on this project. In the United States, where the healthcare industry is tremendously developed, the word transformational is used so casually in reference to various events. However, I think the work we're doing in Ghana will have a transformative impact. Although we knew where we were going, the journey itself will be remembered as the legacy. Luca Health works in collaboration with patients' doctors to provide specialized and same-day surgical care. The Luca Health Medical Specialized Center offers specialty and same-day surgical surgery and adheres to U.S. standards of safety, patient care, and doctor-patient confidentiality. It is situated in the center of Accra. The doctors and nurses at the Luca Health Medical Specialty Center provide patient-centered care in crucial moments for our patients by utilizing the most recent innovations in medical interventions and taking use of our telemedicine partnership with the New York University School of Medicine. Our clinical and nursing team is dedicated to providing patients in Ghana with the same high-quality specialist treatment, same-day surgical interventions, and cutting-edge diagnostics that they may find in the United States, the United Kingdom, and South Africa. In West Africa, we at Luca Health are dedicated to making sure patients get the treatment their doctors recommend without having to wait or travel elsewhere. Top surgeons and doctors from the US, EU, and Ghana are drawn to Luca Health's world-class medical center, which combines their specialized knowledge with cutting-edge medical technology. We are able to provide some of the greatest medical treatment in Africa thanks to this. Modern techniques, such as minimally invasive surgery, are used at our advanced medical center with little incisions. Our specialists provide a secure, welcoming environment where you can receive treatment for your symptoms and ailments with less discomfort and a quicker recovery. Our procedures frequently require less time and allow for a quicker recovery. Our specialists will help you feel better using advanced techniques and equipment, which results in less discomfort and a speedier recovery. Appointments are currently available. Changing Medical Care in Ghana According to Dr. Armstead, 25 of the world's diseases affect 11% of the population in Africa. That refers to people getting chronic illnesses like cancer, diabetes, and hypertension. Whether it's a surgical specialization or a medical specialty, he argues, these astounding figures show the need for filling the exceptional specialized gap. Therefore, in order to receive the necessary medical attention, they had to leave West Africa. They can now receive that care closer to home. As a center of excellence owned and operated by the United States, we will supply these types of solutions through a high-quality patient-centric paradigm, not only to Ghana, but to the rest of West Africa. Instead of people seeking care in India, the UK, or the US, we will become the preferred referral location. 
Wykana. Prior to joining United Healthcare, Dr. Armstead worked briefly for the government during the Clinton administration and was on the lookout for private equity options. Here comes Cheryl Mills, CEO of the sub-Saharan African-based investment company Black Ivy Group. The former U.S. State Department Chief of Staff who identified a great potential to invest in Africa. But which of Africa's more than 50 nations would be the best choice? The country's GDP growth trajectory, the state of its middle class, the stability of its democracy, and the history of its support for private investment were all factors to consider when choosing where to invest. As a result, the search was limited to Ghana, Tanzania, and Kenya in West Africa and East Africa, respectively. Given that Black Ivy had experience working in East Africa, it made appropriate to select a dynamic metropolis with a population of more than 4 million as the hub of Luka Health in West Africa. In the United States, creating a new medical facility only needs determining the demand and meeting it, but in developing nations, there are many more obstacles to overcome, increasing the initial risk. Investors needed to be persuaded that Dr. Armstead could construct the hospitals, entice physicians to practice there, and encourage patients to seek treatment. Because that runs counter to how you would expand in the United States, he claims, it will be difficult to persuade investors of that. After the investment was confirmed, he had to deal with Ghana's peculiarities. Understanding that you must actually be here, live here, understand and accept how they do things, and possess a certain degree of humility is necessary. For instance, he claims that just because something is written in a regulation doesn't necessarily mean it operates in that way. He claims that overcoming this major mental barrier requires being in Africa rather than overseas. Thank you for watching this video to the end. With this new hospital, Ghanaians and Africans will have to stay back home and receive top medical care. If you are new to Africa Reloaded, please take a few seconds to like this video and subscribe. Also, do not forget to turn on the notification bell to get notified when we upload a new video.